Yo, what is up guys, it's Vodzo Beats here and today I'm gonna show you what's in my backpack. This is my travel setup. Every time I leave the studio, I'm just taking those things with me uh, to be able to work outside, to shoot some videos, just to be prepared uh, in any moment. So the first thing is right here. And is, these are the headphones. And these aren't like, like regular headphones, these are the DT-1990s Pro 250 ohm version and these are like the most popular open headphones on the market by open headphones I mean they are they don't have any cover right here so you can hear them pretty loud outside but uh, the thing about those headphones is you can listen to music and mix and you know make beats in them for a few hours and you won't get as tired as you would in some regular headphones. They, are, they have like this telephone cable. I don't quite like it because it's, it's like flimsy and you know it's moving like crazy but the plug is pretty decent too. It, it has like this, you can screw a bigger jack onto it. The second most important thing is the MPD. The reason I am carrying this uh, with me all the time is because this is not only a good piece of gear to play some drums, you know, trap drums, anything. I didn't know that you can actually play melodies on this uh, until I discovered uh, scales built in into this. You can program your own scales, you can select any sound you like and you can just hard program it to the memory of the MPD. This means I have already a few scales programmed in, I'm just holding this button and I'm selecting one. Here is my hint just to know which, which button is which scale so we've got a pretty nice choice of scales. If you want some tutorials about MPD-218 or any other MPD, they are pretty similar, just let me know. My computer, yeah, my lovely computer. This is a 2016 HP Elitebook. I bought it used uh, for like 2000 zloty, which is like, I don't know, $600. Uh, I really enjoyed this piece of computer. The first reason, it's super small. Oh, hey there. It's 12 and a half inch and it's just pretty pretty small you know here is here is my hand but it's not like a netbook you know it's it's not small and it's not big at the same time this is what i'm enjoying uh the second cool thing is it's got the touch screen five point touch screen so i can do some things uh, with my fingers and i thought like it's useless but when you are browsing the internet or maybe you want to uh, move some faders into your daw it's it's pretty usable i really like its keyboard it's pretty lightweight as a whole piece. It's got the Core i7, so it's pretty fast, 16 gigs of RAM. It's of course the i7 with the U at the ending, so it's the power saving one, but it's still pretty decent. Here's this fancy LED book logo. And here I have my card reader for the next piece of gear I'm going to show you. The next thing in my backpack is my DJI Mavic Mini. It's a really trusty piece of filming gear. The box is really small, it's smaller than the laptop itself, so it doesn't take too much space in the backpack. Inside I'm keeping, of course, everything you could expect, so the drone itself, the batteries, the controller and some extra stuff right here, extra props, extra screws, screwdriver. And trust me guys, this drone is a great thing, you can just pack it into your backpack and go anywhere. I'm just carrying it whenever I go, you know. Uh, you can't even predict uh, if you have some opportunity to shoot something interesting. You can always take it out and just shoot some stuff. I've been shooting some stuff today, so it's a little bit discharged. And yeah, that's the tiny drony thing. And the obvious things like cables, charger, stuff like that. And the last thing I'm carrying with myself for most of the time, but I haven't got it this weekend is this small lav microphone. I've got the Rode Smart Lav microphone. Uh, I usually just plug it into my phone. I'm recording with it right now, so I'm not talking to it. Uh, and it's a great thing just to have the sound clear through all the recording because whenever I turn back to the camera, I'm doing some weird stuff. Uh, you can just hear me well. And when I'm recording the cook up series, the beat grinding series, I'm just using it all the time. And it's a really, really good piece of gear. It's been too expensive, I think. 
I paid like 300 Polish zloty for it. So it's like, I don't know, 80, 90 bucks. But I think we pay for this logo right here. But anyways, it sounds great. Uh, it works great and it's really trusty. It just, it always works, you know? And yeah, that's what's in my backpack. You can shoot videos, you can make beats with it. Uh, so it's everything I personally really need. If you have some questions about certain devices, please feel free to leave them in the comment section right below. Also, if you're having any suggestions for another video, just let me know. I would be super happy to answer your questions and maybe make a video about a particular topic you just need to hear about. So, my name is Dominic, you've been watching Vodzu Beats and keep the good vibes alive.